Hey, time to bitch more about Pokemon Go. Uh, I caught a shelter that's a wonder and attack and defense maxed out, so that's cool. That's actually kind of cool. And it's actually max CP for my level 2, and I can evolve it. <laughs> Woo! So, what I'm going to bitch about is, Pokemon Go oh, has a has a cash system where you can buy their coins with actual cash. Oh, this is going to be a heyday. So, the thing that pisses me off about this is, well, you already know what it is, don't you? Yep. Okay, so... I'm going to pull it up here so that we have the prices. So you tell us if this sounds about right. 100 coins. 99 cents. 550 coins. $6.99. Would you like to pull up a calculator and show how fucked up that is? So for $7, you can buy 550 Pokecoins as a bundle. Or, if you buy it separately... You can spend the same amount of money to get seventy or seven hundred Poke coins, and it's literally the same going on. Like thirteen ninety nine for twelve hundred, twenty seven ninety nine for twenty five, fifty four ninety nine for five thousand two hundred. But then the next time it's actually a deal is when it's one hundred and thirty nine ninety nine for fourteen thousand five hundred coins. Which what the mm. fuck, Niantic? <coughs> one of the things I heard was apparently. These prices are relative to the prices in the states, factoring in uh, like the difference in dollar. But the ninety-nine cents for the hundred poker coins is a standard throughout every country. Yeah. So, so like, so I don't know why. Like, why wouldn't you just make it? Like, I, I've based heard some people country. argue that it's because uh, a lot of people always assume that the higher amount is the better deal, so people will make that mistake. Yeah. Which I've heard people make that mistake. At the same time, though, it's so, you know, what the fuck? Like, it yeah. seems so user-hostile that a lot of the people I know who know us that are like, fuck you, Niantic, over that. Yeah, exactly. And it's like, I just can't figure out how it works that way. And who thought that was a good idea in the long run? I could understand if, you know, it was a temporary deal, you know, like... Hey, for this short time, we're going to, you know, give you a deal on the 100 coins for 99 cents. For all those who can only spend, you know, a buck or two on it. Yeah. You know, it sounded like a nice gesture, you know. Although, you know, kind of, eh. Still, it would seem like a nice gesture, but, you know, they're not even doing that. Doesn't matter what game it is, you should always be getting a better deal the more you spend. I wouldn't even say that, just an equal deal, even. Yeah, like, like even if it was like, oh, you could spend 100 for 100 coins... <coughs> Or, or you could spend one dollar for a hundred coins, or you could spend seven dollars for seven hundred coins. Like, and make I it a flat a, rate. And I don't have a ground type, for so... Con just for convenience. Yep. Then I'll just take advantage of my oh. bean, hopefully, so I can fly on this. Sludge. Great. Poison was so bullshit in these games, though. What sucks, too, is sludge is a 30% chance of poison. Holy shit. Yep. <laughs> Well, that also took like half my life. Yeah, that's kind of brutal. <coughs> and I did literally nothing. Oh, he's all 30. Yeah, that's why. Is normal neutral to uh, poison? Nope. No, it's weak to poison? Well, well, oh yeah, sorry, sorry, yeah, normal is neutral. Oh, sorry, I meant fighting. Fighting is not very effective against poison, but is neutral from it. Yeah, for whatever reason, poison re poison resists fighting. Just trying to pick the best uh, new move. Chong's, you know, basically dead. Yeah. And isn't uh, Ghost weak to poison? Uh, Ghost actually resists poison. What? Yeah, there's. I don't know why I always got that backwards. There's some typing or some combinations that I just don't see that make sense. Like I think one that they need, that they should bring back, but kind of makes sense why it didn't, mm -hmm. is uh, bug being weak against poison. Like poison actually being super effective against bug, because it was like that in Gen One initially, yeah. and then Gen Two onwards it wasn't. Which you could say, oh okay, well it's the bugs adapting to the pesticides. But then the same argument should exist for grass type and herbicides. At the same time, though, there's also the argument. Disable. Is that worth putting on Chong? It's not bad. Um, like, I don't, I don't think you should use it. Just because your moveset's already pretty much solidified yeah. at this point. 
Also, he's going to be my HM slave, so yeah. or one of them. Well, part of the other thing is, is a lot of bugs <laughs> use poison could be the argument why, you know, in like actual life, or venom and all that kind of yeah. stuff. At the same time, they use it to kill other bugs. Yeah. I think someone actually brought up a relatively good uh, thing. Mm -hmm. He said, uh, like, the normal type is, like, very basic, like, standard animals and all that. Yeah. Maybe poison should be good against normal. Because yeah. there's nothing really special against these animals. Like, there's just an animal, and if you poison it, well, it's probably going to die. That's a pretty fair point. So, yeah, so, someone said, you know, don't, don't make it where poison resists normal, just make it where poison is super effective against normal. It'll kind of balance it out because right now the normal type it's immune to ghost, and it's weak. F it takes super effective damage from fighting, and it's bad against rock steel and ghost. But oh, bloody yeah. hell! Of course he gets the critical hit. I don't know. It adds a little bit more diversity, and it'll give poison the boost it really needs. Like yep. it being good against fairy types really isn't that much of a boost, really, just because there's very few good poison types. Yeah. So ha having that bonus against. Normal is right. This cloister is now my best Pokemon. Cool. Whoops. Accidentally double clicked on that. Uh oh. I lost hypnosis. Got Confuser. Uh, Confuser is not bad though, it's 100% accuracy. Yeah. The shit ton of Krabbies. I gotta go through all of them now. On the bright side, the first gym we uh, took is good. Still. And I hope I outspeed. I probably don't know. Oh, oh, Weezing is slow. So I just put curse on him. <laughs> yeah. So I'm going to switch to Chong because Chong is going to automatically die. Oh, what? He lost his move because I died. Oh yeah, because if you uh, faint that turn from yourself, yeah. their move still goes through, but because nothing is there, it'll fail. Cool. He outspeeds Chongo because Chong is slow. Er, the fuck. What the hell? Oh, does that mean my uh, cursed uh, damage though doesn't go off? Uh, if you faint, it doesn't go off, I'm pretty sure. I think in this gen. <coughs> yeah, it looks like it's like that. Surf. Smoke screen. Failed. Curse damage. I think that's a really tick move to do, though, when you go, like, against NPCs, that is, because, like, actual players can, you know, switch out. Yeah. To just curse with your last like, 2 HP. So you ha! You're done. Like, he just tackled me, he's taking another... He's now taking 50% of his damage from curse alone. Jesus. Yeah, so Curse really sucks against non-NPCs, but against NPCs, it seems like it's kind of broken. Yeah, it's definitely pretty good to use against them. It, it, it's just such a good condition to afflict them with. He just has like a bunch of coughings and wheezings. It's all he fucking has, I think. It's Team Rocket for you. But still, where's a Persian, a Meowth, a Zubat, a Golbat? Even a Growlithe was occasionally used by them in the car yeah. in the anime. I was about to call it a cartoon. And oh my god, will you get your <laughs> ass kicked for that. Yep. I love anime more than the next person. But let's be honest, it's Japanese cartoons. Yeah, that's pretty much what it is. Mind you, most people are mad because of the connotation that cartoons are for kids. But they're not. I personally don't believe that. Metalocalypse should not... Death Clock should never be watched by little kids. Yeah. Well, except you all fuck them up. So maybe you should uh, let little kids watch it. But, you know... Eh. Eh. There's a lot of cartoons that aren't meant for kids that people, I think, are sensitive because of that. Yeah. I know at one point I was sensitive about that because... Well, kids in junior high are assholes. That is very true. Oh, God. One of my favorite topics. Little kids trying to act hardcore. That's always funny to see. Like when a little kid's trying to scare you, it's like, yo, I carry a knight with me. And it's like, bitch, I carry two. Also, 
My legs are so long, you uh, the only thing you could probably stab is my ankle if I try to <laughs> kick you. Yeah. And guess what? I wear steel toes. So, yeah. I got the basement key. Woohoo! And they have the they have the man <coughs> stuck in the dungeon. <laughs> or stuck in the basement. Ah, <laughs> oh, I can't get around him. So that means I can't get into this. So this whole space here you can't get into then. So this whole space is now blocked. Oh god. No, like that space down there, like there's nothing there at the same time. Though. Oh yeah, I it see. It bothers me I can't go there. Yeah, I can see that, yeah. Wait, what if I... Haha, now I can go here. There we go. And he's standing for the computer, which is why I <laughs> want to see if there's anything on. Trying to find the porn? Oh, potato. If I was trying to find porn, I'd look at your computer. Yeah, fun. <clears throat> What's that? Gardevoir or Nazi for work? Yeah. This, this probably makes no sense without uh, the reference. We're all hanging out looking at um, stuff. We're looking at different Pokemon theories of different uh, looks of Pokemon. I made a joke about uh, Check Out Lola and Gardevoir, which was actually a reference to a comic series, because they actually did that in the Errol and Cart. Uh, comic series. Yeah. So this guy's like, okay, Garbor Nazi for work. <laughs> we all saw things that day, except for him, that we wish we could forget. Yeah, that is very true. That's why Josh isn't here right now. He's in therapy. Yep. We all miss you, little buddy. <laughs> you think they'll believe him when he's, when he tells them that a pota uh, potato showed him <clears throat> porn? Uh, they'd probably be more surprised that he maybe didn't stay to watch it. Oh god, why? Just why? Why not? You are not that Pokemon. Mm. I am not that Pokemon. <coughs> oh, fuck, the underground basement. Is that actually in the... Oh, is that why I have to go through the tunnel system to get through? Uh, yeah, I think you gotta go through the tunnels for a little bit there. Great. Yeah, it's fun. Because you know I love the tunnel system. I wasn't asking about your beliefs about Pokemon or money, surprisingly. Oh, wow. So why are you showing that? What? 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 In the butt. That always ends up coming up somehow. That was like a big saying back in middle school. Well, it's cause of the, it was because of the meme about that. What I find funny is apparently the guy didn't realize he was gay when he wrote that song. He thought he was bisexual at the time. Oh, yeah? He only later came out as gay. Huh. So, um, yeah. He wrote an entire song about being fucked in the butt without realizing he was gay. Nice. I'm not sure how someone does that. Maybe it was an awakening for him. You guys are playing Pokemon, all I can think of is awakening. It only costs 400 Poke Dollars. And shit, I can't remember where the basement is. Because it wasn't here. There you go. No, like... Nothing here. Try going through here. Oh, what? Now it's yeah. let me? Yeah, because I think that's the basement key. No, I just walked up to it like a second uh, ago, though. Oh. It apparently didn't fully react. Uh-oh. Oh, hey, Edgelord. I mean, what's Dalian? <laughs> oh, shit, he wants to fight now. Hey. <laughs> oh, boy. What's Dalian wants to fight? So, which of these Pokemon do you think belong to the guy who um, had his... What's it called? Ah, uh, Shuckle stolen. Or, the guy who gave us a Shuckle. Oh yeah, I remember. <laughs> one of these Pokemon was stolen from him. Which one do you think it is? Okay, well... It's not the Golbat, because he already had Golbat beforehand. 
Or at least a Zubat. Well, that was fun. Yep. Go ahead and switch to Amy. Is that another Confuse Ray? Bite. Ouch. Shit, that actually really hurt. Yeah. Dark type moves. That's great. I forgot I had Bite. <coughs> ha ha ha. Confuse Ray. Take that. Of course. Of course it'll always break through. Uh, uh, back to Chum. Yeah, I forgot I had Bite on it. I kept thinking Leech Life, Confuse, and something else. You might have Wing Attack also. At least now punch itself in the face. Jeez. Okay, I know I'm lower level than him, but I'm not that much lower of a level. Yeah, you really need Psychic. How long until I get that? I think it's like level 36 you get it. Oh my god. Yeah. Oh, he's confused. No, and he uses confuse ray. Of course. Chung, Chung, you know what you have to do. Don't hit yourself in the face. And hit himself in the face. Great. Of course. And he uses bite. And Chong can't take a bite apparently. I'm gonna get my ass kicked now. Nah, you should be all right. Looks like. Because you should be able to eat up any hit that goes for you on. Whatever that does to you. This is still his first Pokemon. Oh god, never mind then. Yeah. I wasn't expecting that bite. I don't know why, I thought he had a wing attack. And something else. <laughs> that experience bar. Jeez. You literally need just like a little bit. Oh, it's <clears throat> Megan in my neck, so this is gonna be easy. Yeah. Did he have a Magnemite before? I don't think so, actually. So he might have stolen a Magnemite. It's definitely an interesting Pokemon from the Steel. I don't know, because we know he had a Zubat before. Okay, Muscle, stop taking your steroids. Meganium says starter. I mean, if you want to be real technical, he stole his starter. Yeah, that too. Uh, what else beats grass other than fire? Fire, flying, bug, and poison, ice. Hey, Eileen, you can do something for once. Oh my god, what the fuck? Yeah, it's kind of terrifying. It looks like someone found a coloring book of dicks and drew a flower around the shaft and antennas. I can see that. Like, how did this become a... Like, I know we talked about how great the sprites are in this game, but what the fuck is with that one? Yeah, some of them really aren't that good. <coughs> like, what the hell happened with that? Yeah. Oh, and it's... Of course. Wait, it actually has speed as me? Or is it speed drop? Because I think I got blown up beforehand. Uh, let's see. Yep, it is faster than you right now. Wow. So one downside with having uh, the basic Pokemon just... Your speed, like, none of your stats are on par, of course, but I think not having that speed is really bad. Yep. Oh, that's right, he'd reflect on his side. Oh, I wonder if this will kill me. But ice beats at two, you said? Yep. Sir Splash, do your work. Now, hopefully he doesn't have grass type move to hurt you with. Good point. Oh, Razor Leaf, there you go. <laughs> is that special or physical, though? Uh, it's 
special because it's a grass type move in this. Oh, what? Yep. All grass type moves are special in this one? Yeah. I put reflect because I thought it was physical. Oh, yeah, Gen 4 on it is. God damn, I need to stop playing Ultra Moon. The physical types for in Gen 1 through 3 mm -hmm. is normal, fighting, ground, rock, poison, steel, bug, ghost. Yeah, that's that's all of them. Um, Which is kind of stupid if you think about ghost, because... You look at the ghost type moves, they're all like, ooh, magical and all that stuff. Yeah. Elemental in a way, I guess, so it should be special. But then the dark type moves, which are like biting and whatever, mm -hmm. is special based. Yeah, I don't know what happened with that either. So Gengar can't even use its typing properly because its stab moves are all physical. And yeah, just they got screwed over. Well, that was a lot of experience. Yeah. Haunter. So yeah. Um. If you have Psychic, Ghost, or Dark, you're good. Or Poison, or uh, Psychic, Ghost, Dark, or can he, Ground. He can hit um, this, right? Yes. And can I, I can't hit him though, right? Unless you use Foresight beforehand, which I think you got rid of, because... I haven't still. Oh, okay, yeah. So, it would uh, be... I have such little health that it's like... You should, yeah, like, if you're going to have Foresight, you should heal up first, like, guarantee. I know he had, the, he had a Gassy beforehand, so... Yeah, he definitely did that. And these are all physical for... God damn it, because I thought it was... I keep forgetting yeah. it's physical now. <laughs> Shadow Ball. Am I dead now? Nope. Because even though it is a physical move, Haunter does not have good physical attack. Ah. Uh. Yeah. That, that's, the, that's the thing that screwed over the Gengar line. Mm -hmm. Was their, their typing is physical, but they're based around being a special attacker. Come on, give me one more crit. No. Oh, Shadow Ball. Yeah, you'll be able to eat that up. And you can take it out one more move. Ah, uh, but what depending on what his last Pokemon is, I got no chance, depending. You just had to heal up. Sneasel, you're fine. Same thing. Sneasel is meant to be a physical attacker. But it's typing makes. Should I switch out or should I? You should stay in and heal. Okay. Heal beep beep. Yep. Just heal beep beep and. Uh, that shiny. I wish it was shiny. That's just the regular Sneasel. I didn't realize this feathers were blue in this color form. Yeah, I like that coloring a bit more. Like I thought it had red feathers though. Gen three on, they gave it red. Oh. Yeah, because the t the coloring in Gen two wasn't officially finished, I guess. Yeah, just super potion up. You should be fine. Because, yeah, it's meant to be a, a special attacker. Or, it, it's it's a physical attacker with a special typing. So this should do literally nothing to you. Especially if you have light screen still up. I haven't put it up yet. Oh, yeah, so... Now have that damage. You're not taking... You're, unless it has slash. That's the only thing you have to worry about. Yeah. Two faint attacks, so... Hmm. Yeah, so set the reflect, heal up, and then you should just be able to spam, like, Thundershock. Hell, I would Thunder Wave at first, and then go with Thundershock. Mm -hmm. Yay, potion spamming. Yay. In fairness, I did not remember this fight was happening. Yeah. I mean, in something like this... In fairness, though, I was... And against me, though, my Pokemon were healed up before this fight started. But I even, just suck. Even then, like, you really can't... Like, yes, yeah, potion spamming, it's not fun, but... Was Sneasel the one he took from the guy, you think? It might have been. Because Sneasel is generally a later Pokemon that you find, because it is Ice-type. And you don't normally find Ice-types early. Like, mm -hmm. ever. But, uh... What is it? What was I going to say? That was a critical hit. I did like jack shit. <laughs> Should probably heal after this attack. Oh, it's because he switched to Quick Attack. Yeah. It's like, why is that? Why am I taking so much damage now? It's like, he switched to Quick Attack. Oh, my light screen's off now. Well. Potion, potion, potion. Oh yeah, I remember, yeah. Yeah, potion spamming sucks. 
But when, when you're only using basic stage Pokemon, and the opponent can use Evolved, you kind of have to do it sometimes. In fairness, this is kind of a set of rules that, you know, we, we impose upon ourselves. Yeah. Me even then, like, I wouldn't, ex I wouldn't expect anyone to run through the game with, like, a Mareep and not have to use potions for a couple battles. Like, especially when, it co when it's at this point, when mm -hmm. they have some pretty strong Pokemon to begin with. Yeah. <coughs> I accidentally used Thunder Wave. Oh. <laughs> Should be able to live a hit no matter what, though. Good job, Ed. Last resort, if you have to, mm -hmm. going into uh, Muscle if you really needed to, but I think one heal and you should be able to finish this off. Actually, I might be able to get away with this without healing. I'm taking the risk. Okay. If you don't live this, you will need to heal Muscle for sure. Beep, beep comes through. Yay! <laughs> My fluffy yellow sheep. Which I wish was pink, because... If it was a shiny, that'd be sweet. Yeah, so like, why... So they changed the color of the feathers for... I don't know why, like, may maybe, uh... It was a design change at the end. That didn't make it into, uh, the game normally. When it's normally. shiny, is its thing blue now? Ugh, I wish. It's shiny turns its black skin to a bright pink, and the feathers turn yellow. I feel like it would have been a cool nod to this game if uh, they had kept it, if they had changed it to blue. Yeah. Uh, that's actually what a lot of people wanted. Like, make its skin darker or even more like the brown it has here. Mm -hmm. And then make the feathers blue. Like, perfect shiny. Done. Yep. The coloring that they gave it would be so much better if used differently. Okay. Well, we're going to end it here because that dragged on. Yeah, that was a bit long. Thanks for joining us. Of course, if you didn't join us, fuck you. At the same time, though, what you go do about because you never heard this. Yeah, because no one watches these things. My favorite fucking joke overdone by...